player Lorenzen Wright was found murdered in a field in Memphis, Tennessee. A new twist in the case. His ex-wife, Shara Wright Robinson, has been arrested and charged in connection with the basketball star's death, along with a second suspect, a man identified as Billy Ray Turner. He was arraigned earlier this week and is being held at the Shelby County Jail in Memphis. The district attorney spoke about the charges earlier today. There are bits and pieces to this case that have been solved. But the defendants that have been indicted this week, uh, Tuesday, the Shelby County Grand Jury returned indictments against Shara Wright and Billy Turner for conspiracy to kill Lorenzen Wright and first degree murder of Lorenzen Wright. They are presumed innocent until proven guilty. When police were asked about the relationship between the two suspects, uh, police said, quote, it's safe to say they knew each other. Wow. So after nine years of this man being dead and gone, he is just now finally getting some justice. Former NBA player, center Lorenzen Wright was murdered and his wife, ex-wife, Shara Wright, is now pleading guilty to having him killed. All right. So it was in July of 2010 that Lorenzen Wright's body was found bullet riddled all right he had been shot up in this Memphis where he'd been missing for 10 days before his body was discovered on July 28th so Shara Wright who is his ex-wife did plead guilty on this Thursday July 25th to facilitation of first degree murder and facilitation of a criminal attempt to commit first degree murder now she was sentenced to 30 years in prison and the judge said that she'd be eligible for parole in about nine years she has already spent about 20 months behind bars which that time will be credited towards her sentence now Wright did initially plead not guilty all right because at that time she was supposed to go on trial for first degree murder and she was facing a life sentence if she was found guilty but basically her defense wanted to say that she did this act or had her husband uh, killed because he consistently had beat her for years and she wanted it to stop her lawyer said that the beatings were consistent and it led to her face being disfigured she was in fear for her life because mr wright would never leave her alone and so she ended up recruiting billy turner to kill mr wright so at that time you know, Cheryl Wright had been divorced from her NBA husband for five months and she collected a $1 million life insurance policy that was paid out at his death. And it was supposed to go towards the benefit their six children that they shared together. But she quickly ended up spending the $1 million. And, you know, as it was reported in the CNN video, Wright did know Billy Turner beforehand. And so they met at a church. They both attended and then they hatched this plan together to kill Lorenzen Wright. After the murder, the pair worked together to get rid of one of the guns in a Mississippi Lake, which police did find years later. And that was the discovery that led to Cheryl Wright and Billy Turner being charged in December of 2017. Billy Turner is a landscaper and a church deacon and he will face his trial for the crime on September 16th. He's pleading not guilty to the charges of murder and conspiracy to commit murder, but he has already pleaded guilty to a gun charge. Pretty uh, sad, but good for Lorenzo Wright and his family that they're getting justice. Now, Lorenzo Wright did play in the NBA for 13 seasons. He played with Memphis Grizzlies, Los Angeles Clippers, Atlanta Hawks, Sacramento Kings, and Cleveland Cavaliers. All right, so let us know what you think about this. Leave a comment. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more messy entertainment.